My name is Asian Mills. I'm 20 years old. Well, I started rapping like elementary school, but mm -hmm. my first song was like recorded like my freshman year of high school. Okay. So I've been rapping for like a minute now. <laughs> was that moment nerve wracking for you? For like my first time? Yeah, first time recording or like. No, it was yeah. actually like fun. Like I was ready to go to the studio and record my first song because mm -hmm. I was so tempted mm -hmm. to see what it's like to finally be in the studio. Mm -hmm. And my uncle, he was actually the first person to take me to the studio. And everything, so yeah. Mm, okay. And I saw you got a couple videos uh, of yourself, like from 2010, uh -uh. rapping and everything. <laughs> and uh, who influenced you when it came to this rap game? My bro, Chavo. Oh, Chavo. He influenced me. He okay. influenced me a lot. Like the boy that's in the video with me. Mm -hmm. The old ones you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. Do you have any um, artists that influenced you? Like mainstream artists, yes. Nicki Minaj, that's Nicki. my favorite artist. Oh, that's your favorite. Yes. Oh, wow. So and it's so crazy because uh -huh. if I was to blow up, uh -huh. she probably she probably diss me. You know how that goes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna ask you about that. Why do you think um, female rappers like they? How come it's like a rivalry between them? You know, like it's it's well, all it's always tension. I think females is rowdy. Period. So mm -hmm. when it come to music and in competition, mm -hmm. they always want to be like. In, in the lead, like they can probably fool with the artists and everything, but mm -hmm. they still want to be that person. That's <laughs> that's that's the talk of the town right now. For yeah. Real. So I think that's what it be. And so, people just be feeling themselves. So. Yeah. So what did you think about the uh, the disc, the Remy Ma disc with Nicki? I think it's fake. <laughs> <laughs> I really do think it's fake because at one point in time they was talking to each other, like mm -hmm. they was she was scream free Remy and all that type stuff and mm -hmm. everything. So I think it's just for publicity. For oh, okay. Real. Well, I saw, see, now, six years ago, though, when you, when, when your boy was naming all these rappers, like Lil' Kim, Remy Ma, mm -hmm. you stopped them before you could say Lil' Kim or whatever. And he's like, no Lil' Kim. What's your, beef, or what's your problem with Lil' Kim? I really don't have no problem with Lil' <laughs> Kim, for real. It's just that Nikki is my favorite. And then okay. I just don't like how she come at her about the swag or whatever. You know how people still swag every day and people don't be out there like, oh, I got this from this and that person. Mm -hmm. So I don't feel as though she need to be like, yeah, like confirm this is where I got my swag from or whatever. People mm -hmm. still trends all day, every day. So yeah. I just think she been extra. Because if they was to like not be beefing, they really can make some real good music with each other. I mm -hmm. believe Nicki and Kim, that will be a good collab. Oh, that's def definitely, that's definitely. Now, do you do your own writing? Mm -hmm. I write all my music. And do you ever go through writer's block? Yes, all the time. <laughs> <laughs> all the time. I got to take a break. Like, I can't like finish... If I'm in the mood to finish a song in one day, I will, but I gotta like take a break, a couple hours, and probably finish it the next day, and then it'll be done. Okay. Now, when do you know, like, when you have like a hit on your hands or like a banger, like you're feeling this, you're like, okay, as you're writing the song, you're like, okay, I know the people are gonna feel this. Like, when do you start? How does, how does that feel to you? When the song is already written and done, and I wake up every day and just say it, just mm -hmm. go to my notes and just mm -hmm. say it all over again. Mm -hmm. That's when I know. Because I did that. You heard my 10 bands before? Yes. I did that to my 10 bands, and everybody liked it as soon as I dropped it. Like, I would just wake up and just play the <laughs> beat every day just to say it in my room, in the mirror or something. Okay. <laughs> now, how long have you known uh, B. Miles? I just met uh, B. Miles like a year ago. Okay. In like the beginning of probably 2016, like towards the middle. Okay. And I see you guys, you uh, did a video together. Mm -hmm. How was that? It looked like it was fun. It was turf. It was fun. <laughs> that was really our first video. And we was like just getting close to each other and all that for mm -hmm. real. Because we met at the um, um, Brody Brothers studio. Mm -hmm. Like that's who I'm affiliated with. Mm -hmm. And he was in there recording and he had his song playing and everything. I'm like, this you? <laughs> And he like, yeah, I'm like, yeah, that's John Turner. And then from there, we just been, we just clicked like that. Okay. Yep. Now, you guys made that song where you both in the studio together, or like one person was in the studio, then the other person got into the studio? Well, we something. was in there together, but oh, the okay. scene, when I'm in the booth, I was just in there by myself. Gotcha. Yeah, but we um just recorded them separate and everything. Oh, man. That seemed like it was fun though, like the video, because you guys had a whole bunch of people there. Yeah, it was. The, the energy it was, was basically uh, everybody that was in the studio. We all were just like, all right, we leaving the studio, we're about to go shoot this video. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it was crazy. So, what do you see yourself in, like, um, you know, like, I want to say three to four years? What do you see yourself? I see myself, like, just like getting out there, probably, mm -hmm. like, knowing people, more networking and everything. Because I don't see myself being, like, no doctor or no lawyer or nothing mm -hmm. like that like i want to be like a famous artist mm -hmm. for real like i don't i don't see myself or if i don't make it in music 
I see myself producing for other people and everything like that, mm -hmm. or a fashion designer. I just don't want to be behind the desk and <laughs> I'm like that. <laughs> oh man. So uh, when it, I can tell you have like like passion for this. It's very strong. So yes. when you, when you just wake up and it's like okay, I need to go to the studio or I need to write or I need to. It, it's every day you wake up. Do you contribute to your music? Yeah, every day. Mm -hmm. I even like contribute when I listen to other artists' music and everything, like mm -hmm. to give me new ideas. Mm -hmm. What's going to be on my next song? That's how I contrib contribute to myself, mm -hmm. my music. Okay. Do you have anything on iTunes or Google Play yet? Or everything's just on Spinrilla and stuff? Yeah, not yet. I don't got nothing on iTunes yet. Just all okay. YouTube, SoundCloud, Spinrilla. And you're an independent artist right now? Mm -hmm. Do you want to be signed? Uh, like depends, if Sony, it if Sony came to here today and said, "Hey, we want to sign you," would you accept it? Like depending on the deal and the money. Yeah, I definitely okay. would. Okay. I definitely would. That's great. Now, who do you want to? Uh, let's say you know you do make it. Like let's say in, in two years, you're at uh, the VMAs or mm -hmm. you're at the BET Awards. Who would you love to meet? I know it's Nicki, but anybody else? Any other females or any other artists in the game? I would love to meet. Mm, let's see. I want to meet Meek Mills. Okay. I never met Meek before. <laughs> <laughs> he just seemed like so like thorough and cool for real. Just because I'm from Delaware, he from Philly. That's like right there. So it's mm -hmm. probably like so much similarities we got. Even though he a male, I'm a female. But mm -hmm. you know, I want to meet Meek. Yeah, I noticed a lot of people from Delaware do like Meek because I guess because. You know, Philly's close, and then they said they watched him come exactly. from the bottom all the exactly. way to the top. He was over West Side getting all his mixtapes and stuff. Like, how could you not respect Meek Mill? Yeah, it was like he really was just you know making those YouTube videos, mm -hmm. and y'all really just watched him grow up basically. Exactly. So I Putting can understand. That yeah, I can understand the fan base when it comes to that. What are your um, top five rappers of all time? My top five. Mm -hmm. Right now. Uh, about, no, you know what? Um, dead or alive. Right, like of all, to, okay. of all time, yeah. I like Biggie. Mm -hmm. I like Kim, mm -hmm. even though she, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I like, um, um, I like Jay-Z. Mm -hmm. And I actually like Young Thug. Okay. He really hot. And who else would be my last one? Future. Future, okay. Yep. That's a nice. And you, you have a uh, a very New York swag to you. Like, For real? Yeah. <laughs> I never heard that before. That's like, the first time somebody told me that. I guess you know, like, the um, the edginess, hardcore, uh -uh. Um, especially, like, when you rap and everything. And, uh, like, even though you don't have the accent or anything, like, yeah. I would be like, oh, snap, she looks like a New York girl. Like, <laughs> it's just crazy. Do you, um, oh, do you like, um, Days Loaf? Yeah. Okay. People tell me that's <laughs> right. Um, they I remind them of her. Yeah. Like my swag or something like that. Mm -hmm. Seriously, I don't know what it be. Mm -hmm. I think it's just this hairstyle. Cause before I got this, nobody yeah. used to tell me I look like Dej Loaf, or yeah. I remind them of Dej Loaf, and then I got this and. <laughs> I look like Dej Loaf now. <laughs> yeah, that's probably what it is. I think it's the hairstyle. Yeah. Shout so. out Dej Loaf though. <laughs> um, do you have any other collaborations you would like to do with any people, like anybody in Delaware? Oh yeah, a whole bunch, mm -hmm. much more I didn't even collab with yet. I would mm -hmm. like to do, cause me and Mac, mm -hmm. Thrill Two, we mm -hmm. still have to do a song together. I would like to collab with Quaddy Diesel. Uh, um, it's it's a whole bunch. I yeah. can't even name them like right <laughs> off the top, cause we all in the group message right now. Like we, mm -hmm. Mac, she put together this mov this movement called um, Three V, and it's basically Delaware versus everybody. So we all just came together, like everybody who we know who rap in Delaware. Mm -hmm. And we just basically like supporting each other and collabing and networking and doing features with everybody who basically in the group message. So that's that's a start to collab with other artists in Delaware so far. Cool. Now, do you have anything coming out this summer or in the fall? Yeah, a lot. I definitely got to get my visuals, mm -hmm. more visuals. Um, I'm starting to work on a new tape because the one on Spinrilla, that's my first one live from the booth. So mm -hmm. I'm putting my second project together soon. I don't got a name or anything yet. I'm just basically just writing mm -hmm. songs to it now. Okay, cool. Oh, and then do you do like, um, are you going to have any like shows coming up or like um, any like live shows? Um, Not right now. I don't okay. have anything set up, but mm -hmm. it's definitely everything's coming soon this summer. Not even just the summer. Like yeah. as we speak, it's coming. Gotcha. It's coming. Seriously. Because yeah. I heard like when, when a lot of local rappers like in Delaware, 
I heard that's when the money comes in when you guys do the live shows. <laughs> yeah. Well, I haven't even like been telling people I'm charging for shows yet because mm -hmm. I want to like get my name out there and all that. Then I can start. Okay. Charging for shows and all that, but right now I'm not really charging nobody. I feel you. Or nothing like that. I love the green. I can count it back to back. Over and over again. In my own lane, you know that that's a fact. I won't let nobody in. I spend it all to know how to get it back. These bitches know how I've been. And when it come to merely fucking up the tracks, these bitches know I'm a win. Bitch, I was never gonna lose. These bitches sleeping on snooze. It's either her or the money. You know what Asia gonna choose. And bitch, I was always a boss. Never was into the rules. I just like hundreds on hundreds. Giving these bitches the blues. Been doing this for the minute. This shit ain't new to me. These bitches just hopping in it. This shit is true to me. I just wanna cop up and spend it. That shit be cool to me. And I'm not the same bitch, I'm different. They wishing they knew of me. Okay. Finessing from next on these bitches and not in the gym, but I hold my weight. I never would stress over niggas, not, not catching no feelings, don't go on dates. I never would fuck with these bitches, you know that they iffy, you know they hate. All of my bitches, they bad and they spurging, they getting that crocker, you know they can't. Uh, you know these hoes, they not in my lane. Different clothes, different roles, we are not the same. I'm getting different money every day. Get that dough, then them hoes come each and every way. Oh no, bitch, we did not come to play. I send my bitches to walk down with a hundred K. I see you bitches on another day. All my niggas making moves, we got a hundred plays. Know these hoes, they not in my lane. I'm a boss, bitch, I'm with it, we are not the same. And these bitches is a bunch of lanes. Yes, I'm with them heavy shooters, they got heavy aids. Yeah, you know I'm reppin' steady gang. I was always on go, reppin' ready gang. Know some niggas who got heavy things. Where I'm from, they get no fucks, they hittin' anything. Yeah, they know that I'm the hottest bitch. I just do just what I want because I got the shit. Yeah, you know I'm really poppin', bitch. Get some money in your pocket, bitch. I be stuck up on that profit shit. I keep my distance, bitches fucking with the ops and shit. And if I like it, get some copy shit. You bitches hating, put some money in your pocket, bitch. Mm.